tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Dito ka na mag-research online kung ano man, kasi lahat ng mga artist, history of different art forms, music, theater, dance, architecture, uh, visual art, cinema, broadcast. Dito makikita lahat sa tinatawag natin na Nakakatawa. online ng CCP. Nakakatawa. Itong nangyayari, Chris, uh, it is a, a, a tragic thing, the pandemic. Pero madami din siyang binubungang napakagandang mga development sa CCP. Kaya sinasabi namin, ngayong quarantine period, marahil malamang sarado ang gusali pero tuloy ang sine sa CCP. We, um, these films, definitely it can be arranged. But then again, we need to cooperate now with the producers of the films because a lot of these films are actually available na. Some of them are already on YouTube or in other video streaming platforms. So, para to put them together in one platform, uh, we will need to uh, uh, talk to the producers again. Pero talking about Cinemalaya, uh, the festival which was uh, meant to happen this coming uh, August um, is uh, suspended or cancelled. But a portion of it is going through online, which is the short film uh, competition. The short film competition will push through online as, a, uh, as an online festival. And being an online festival, it will not only about be about screening, but there will be about there will also be talkbacks with filmmakers, workshops. There will also be online exhibits. Parang the way we did the festival at the at, at the CCP during uh, August. So in uh, the, the, what will happen to the rest of the competition full length films? It will push through for next year. So in 2021, okay. instead of having 10 competition films, we will have 20 competition films. For the 2021, so that's it's it's it's, that's it's very exciting. Yeah. Talagang uh, his name uh, uh, is something is just so significant uh, to a lot of people, not just uh, for cinema goers, cinema lovers, but even for film students, even for uh, for even for theater. Yeah. Salamat for giving us the chance to. Uh, t t tell the tell our public so uh, anong ginagawa natin during this uh, COVID times and of course kung anong paghahanda naman natin for the post-COVID recovery period. At syempre, kasama nito sa pasasalamat ay patuloy na panalangin na sana ay uh, matapos na ito, itong pandemic na ito na nakaapekto sa buhay ng nilamang na mga artista, manunulat, cultural workers, kundi rin na ating mga kababayan at uh, mga tao sa buong mundo. At uh, Siyempre, kasama din dito yung uh, pag-asa na sana eh, magkikita-kita tayong lahat no? sa ulit. Sa, at um, maaari na tayo ngayon uh, mag-beso-beso at magpangayan at magkasama sa isang uh, usali na walang takot na magkahawaan. Uh, uloy na pag-ingat uh, sa, sa lahat ng kabayan natin at nagpapakinig. Ladies and gentlemen, wag po nating kakalimutan na ang Cultural Center of the Philippines ay yaman ng ating bansa. Ito po ay part ng ating, uh, ng ating pagka-Pilipino. At sana po ay tangkilikin po natin ang mga nasa online channel ng CCP. Hanapin lang po sila sa Facebook at sa YouTube. CCP at 50. At uh, sigurado po akong matliligayahan kayo sa inyong mga mapapanood doon. At Sa mga dadating na araw, asahan nyo na magkakaroon pa rin ng mga iba't ibang palabas na i-digitize at mailalagay sa itong sa mga digital platforms na ito. Finally, ladies and gentlemen, nagpapasalamat po ako. Ito po si Tita Gracie. Wishing you all a safe week ahead. And please, take care, practice social distancing, and... Always remember that somebody up there is watching over us. This too shall pass. Thank you. Stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on Z81 Radio, Manila.